here, I have what looks like a drink container. Uh, this is going to be the hat that we pass around. If you have anything that you'd like to, to give to our featured performer, we would welcome it. Um, if you look on the screen in just a little bit, there'll be some links for some Venmo and other sites as well to access Cherith's music and to contribute to her. So anything you want to give, we appreciate it, and I think she does too. I mean, I need as much McDonald's in my life as I can, so... <laughs> Am I coming through on the uke? Good, okay. All right, so last time I was here, I did only um, piano, and Rob so nicely reached out and was like, come back, and I was like, okay. So I brought my uke this time. <laughs> Thank you. Um, I'm here, as I said last time, because Michelle Swan's in my life, which is a good thing most of the time. I think all the time so far, but don't want to knock on, I'll knock on wood on that. I thought I would start off with the first song that I wrote, not on ukulele, the first song I wrote. First song I wrote was in fifth grade and it was horrible and I will never ever play it. This song is the COVID song that every musician has. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna get out of bed today I don't think that I can find a good way to get up and fight this pain All this living in a box is keeping me down Never thought I'd live to see the day when the world stops spinning round, around, around Around, around, around And all this sad scene Of you and me hatching a scheme To see the latest show on the silver screen Cause it's a selfish thing when I'm on in the lost of Please tell me we're just dreaming Cause I know I'm not the only one feeling the same I see the digital profiles crying the same damn thing My dear, I know we don't always agree Yes, the record of death sits disturbing in but still I miss that scene Of you and me hatching a scheme To see the latest show on the silver screen Guess it's a selfish thing But I'm on in the loss of a weekend morning Think I might start screaming Please tell me we're just dreaming Oh, I was lost Do we even want to? I'm scared of what comes next But darling, I'll try my best Because I'm a sad scene Of you and me hatching a scheme To see the latest show on the silver screen Cause it's a selfish thing But I'm on in the lost of Please tell me we're just dreaming Because I'm inside seeing Oh, I'm inside seeing oh. Thank you. 
Next, uh, this song I wrote for my great aunt, who um, is probably one of my favorite people in the world. I lost her uh, five years ago, six years ago. Actually, more than that. We weren't even married yet, were we? Seven, eight years ago. <laughs> um, she was obsessed with Elvis, absolutely obsessed with Elvis. I everything Elvis, dishes, crochet, pillows, VHS tapes. I think her TV even had like Elvis on it. I don't know. A lot of Elvis stuff fits in a um, trailer. <laughs> um, but this one's for her. Thank you. This uh, next one I haven't performed yet other than in New York for my friends and family. So it's like a kind of a release, I guess, here. It's about a friend that I had in high school. Everyone thought we should date. And because everyone thought that we should date, I absolutely did not want to date because you told me to do something. I don't want to do it. Um, but looking back, it's kind of too bad because I think I would have had a lot of fun with him. Um, so, all right. It's called See You Again. Park bench, boardwalks we play. I'd say I 
couldn't wait to see you again. Years passed, we've stopped being that way. What's left just the things we'd never say. I guess I always thought I'd see you again. Late nights, driving in movies, I fell and knew you carried me and you'd say you couldn't wait to see me again. Looking back now, I don't know, black water, keep on rolling, someday I'll, I'll Thank you. Go into the piano. I started having wrist issues, so I can't uh, scrunch up to the piano like I used to. <laughs> I usually have to sit a little far back. Okay, so usually I use things like this or Michelle's open mics or me and Michelle uh, singing together in general as motivation to write new songs. So I did the same thing. So here is Santa Spring open mic special song that <laughs> you motivated me to write. <laughs> it's called Enough. My husband and I often talk about how in relationships one person can't be 
kind of everything that society kind of at least preps women to think they have to be or that their husbands have to be. Um, and it's kind of about kind of just contemplating that and the sadness that goes into realizing that. Thank you, Michelle. <laughs> Thank you. And for my uh, last song, I'm gonna ask the, the fabulous Michelle Swan to come up. <laughs> she has been so encouraging. Before her, I didn't do any originals. I didn't do anything out in public. I only did covers of the Honky Tonk Casanovas and she has been the one that's just like pushed me off the cliff and said, girl, go do it. Cause you're so good. <laughs> and it's really hot that mic. He's doing <laughs> harmonies. Harmonies. I'll come a little closer. This one is called Everything I Need. It's a very fun song. I wrote a lot of sad love songs, so this one is specifically for Ben. And this definitely is our story. Just about right. Um, okay, I hope you like it. Uh, wow, it's terrible. Kept wanting to start with one. You were playing up the scene that day. No, I don't know what's came to take us away. You were planning to stay. I was going insane. Talking circles in your same old way. Logic be damned. damned. I couldn't stand the feeling. 
Sheriff Hewley. Thank you. Thank you, Sandy Spring Museum. It's been an honor. Well, thank you, Sheriff. How, who comes and writes a song for the open mic? How about that? Thank you so much. That was great. And Michelle, it's always lovely to have you up here. Um, again, please uh, visit Cherith's website, check out her music. We hope to have you back, and I, I feel like there's another fe uh, feature in the future. That was a tongue tie. 